Ooh. Oh my goodness. Ooh. Look at this. She is so juicy. Man, this sour sop is sour sopping for sure. And this coconut water, so hydrative, the best. But when I fast, I feel so divine. Like I feel like nothing can touch me when I'm fasting. My downloads from the most high are clear, puts me in a heightened state. You start to notice a lot about yourself when you fasting. We are really addicted to this food. Sometimes I used to go eat and I just got done eating maybe an hour ago. Like Jazz, you are not hungry. I was programmed, programmed to eat. Every hour on the hour, I gotta eat something. Digestive tract just is clogged up. See, when your gut clogged up, your mind is clogged up. Cause you gotta think, our gut is our first brain. That's our first initial way of eating. We absorb nutrients through our mother. If this is clogged up, oh, best believe your mind is clogged up. Family, I am so excited today, man. I got a special video for y'all today. We're gonna do a mukbang slash chop it up session. I'm finna just be real with y'all right now. <laughs> but before we get into this, I just wanna say peace and love to all of my new subscribers. My channel has definitely been growing. If you don't know me, my name is Jazz Avante. I'm a licensed massage therapist, divine healer, and my purpose is to help people to mold themselves into their most healthiest version mentally, physically, spiritually, all right? Today, I got a special one. I got my favorite fruit of all time. She is so juicy and ready to go. Look how big this is. Big as my face. If you know, you know, we got that sour sop. Oh my gosh, bro. And I'm fasted too. Then we got some fresh coconut. I'm gonna just dig on in. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Ooh, look at this. She is so juicy. I'm about to smash, okay? <laughs> Y'all don't understand how excited I am. First of all, before I even get into what we gonna talk about, it's a love-hate relationship with these sour sops. First of all, you rarely find them in a the store and when you do, they be extra hard so you don't even really be finding them for real. Mm. I say the seeds, sour sop tree coming soon. Mm. First thing of the day, it's about 6 p.m. right now. When you find a sour sop, get it when it's already soft. Don't get it when it's hard. Cause every time I get a sour sop and it's hard, thinking that it's gonna ripen in a couple days, it always go bad. Mm. Let me show this to y'all. Look at this, this thing is just juicy. Mmm. Say your seeds. I remember the first time trying sour sop. Instantly hooked. Mmm. <laughs> Y'all just don't know the divine feeling that is submerged on me right now. Oh my gosh, man. Mmm. Let me go get a towel. I needed that towel, man, cause good googly moogly. That thing is juicy. Hey, what you know about that? <laughs> Look at that. Ooh. Mm. Mm. Listen, do your research on Sarasop. It's the queen of all queens. Rich in antioxidants, helps regulate your blood sugar levels, blood pressure as well. It boosts your immune system, it has anti-inflammatory properties in it, this fruit can fight off cancerous cells. This fruit right here is the goddess. Every time I get a good one, ooh, it just makes my body feel so heavenly. <laughs> Cheers. But I wanted to get on here and talk about specifically how fasting has changed my life, family. I was first introduced to fasting um, a couple of years ago. I was fresh out of college and I was in that in between period rehabbing going overseas to play basketball and I was at home you know living with my parents and that's when I was really engulfed in my spiritual journey and I started to see people talking about fasting and and all of these things and so I tried it for a little bit back then but last year in 2023 that's when I really got in deep into fasting. I would go 72 hour fast. 
Last year I did my first raw vegan cleanse, which is I only did raw fruits and veggies, nothing cooked. But when I fast, I feel so divine. Like I feel like nothing can touch me when I'm fasting, you know? My downloads from the most high are clear. My dreams are clear. My intuition, I'm aligned and everything is just in tune when I'm fasted. If you haven't tried fasting family, it is a transformative experience. And typically when people hear fasting, oh, they think you can't eat nothing for a certain amount of days, a drastic amount of days. No, start small. Anybody that asks me, hey Jazz, what would you recommend getting into fasting? I will always say, just start off small. If you are used to eating two, three meals a day, dial it back to one meal. Just only go, oh my, one meal a day. Give yourself an eating window in which you can eat. Like when I first started to fast, I did OMAD. Oh I would go all day without eating, of course hydrating, but I would have my one meal in the nighttime when I was done with everything, when I was done with my clients, done working, I would have my meal in the nighttime and that really helped me to gain tremendous results in my body because at that point in time, I was still harboring a lot of fat, you know, around my arms and chest and things like that. And so when I went OMAD, oh I went OMAD oh for six months and man, it helped me. It helped me so much. I'm gonna put in a, a picture so y'all can see, but definitely recommend somebody start with just going one meal a day and just see how that works. What works best for me is intermittent fasting. Maybe do one meal a day. I have seen tremendous results. Another reason why fasting has totally transformed my life. I don't get upset like I used to. Like things do not upset me. <laughs> I low key used to have a little temper, man. I remember the smallest things would tick me off. But now I just be like, oh, okay. It is what it is. It's all good. Like <laughs> another reason I don't stress. I do not stress about nothing because everything is already written. Everything is written. Family, we don't have to stress anything that we have zero control over. Why are we stressing? Why are we harboring this anxiety? this depression, why are we latching our energy to that, that low vibrational frequency? It's in our food, it's in our lifestyle. We work and work and work and, and we never get a chance to pour into ourselves and really make sure that we're good internally, spiritually, emotionally, physically. Cause when you stuck in that rat race, you forget about what's really important, which is you and your connection. Are you actually grounded? Are you living your purpose? Because it just, it puts me in a heightened state. You start to notice a lot about yourself when you fast them. We are really addicted to this food. We really are. Sometimes I used to go eat and I just got done eating maybe an hour ago. Like, Jazz, you are not hungry. I was programmed, programmed to eat. Every hour on the hour, I gotta eat something. Digestive tract just is clogged up. See, when your gut clogged up, your mind is clogged up. Cause you gotta think, our gut is our first brain. That's our first initial way of eating. We eat and we absorb nutrients through our mother. This right here, if this is clogged up, oh, best believe your mind is clogged up. I'm able to manifest things. And I'm not just talking about worldly things. I'm talking about internal, internal blessings. I'm talking about real peace. Y'all, my peace of mind right now, <laughs> I wake up every day just thanking the most high. Thank you, God. I have real peace of mind. I have a stress-free life because I understand, I understand that everything is already written. 
and the vision that I have over my life, it surpasses all of this worldly stuff. We seeking to heal internally first. We're seeking to touch as many people as we can with this healing. That's one of the reasons why I got into massage therapy. Story time. A lot of people ask me, Jazz, what got you into massage therapy? Because, you know, people always knew me as training, hooping, you know, and, and that. But what got me into going into massage therapy is I was fasting. I went on a fast and one day I was loving on myself and the most I just told me, Jazz, enroll yourself in school. Enroll yourself in a massage therapy school. If you would have asked me a month prior to that, I didn't know that I was going to be a massage therapist. Like, spirit told me clear as day enroll yourself in school I said okay God say no more <laughs> I got right up I went on my phone did my research I went to the school I signed myself up I put I put down my deposit now at that point in time the the tuition was definitely more than what I had but I'm like I'm not even gonna worry about that I'm gonna follow this divine order that I just got from the most high and how I was able to tap in into that was I was fasting at that point in time I think I was on day 12 I think I was on day 12 on my fast on my 30 day fast so man fasting has totally recalibrated rejuvenated my whole being if you've been thinking about going on a fast fam, please do it. Don't see what see what people mess up is when they look at all these big numbers. People that went on 90 day, 120 day, all fruit fast, like focus on day by day. Take it day by day, because when you look at that type of stuff, you, you want to. It's a competition. Uh uh. You got to want to do it for you. See, deep down, I knew that I needed to make a change. You start taking actions on cleansing and actually detoxing your body, your senses are going to start getting more sensitive. When they say your third eye opens, I really believe in that, but I don't even think it's your third eye. I don't even, I don't even believe it's your third eye. It's your first eye. You wake up and you got that crust in your eye. That's the same thing you do when you fast. You decalcify your first eye, fam. Take it from somebody who's done it. <sighs> I'm so glad that I've been obedient. Because I'm seeing my life change right in front of my eyes. I don't have not a worry in this world. And to be quite honest with you, I could be pulling my hair out right now in this moment. Why? Why? Do you know the most high I serve? <laughs> Do you know the most high that I serve? I'm like that song, don't worry. Do, do, be happy. <laughs> Type is. It's something that you just have to experience on your own. I am so grateful for this moment. I am so grateful to be sitting here talking to y'all right here. I'm grateful for y'all tapping into this video. I'm grateful for everybody subscribing to my channel. It's only the beginning, fam. If you still here looking at this video, this video was definitely for you. If you feel like... That's, a, that's beautiful. You just feel like your life is in shambles right now. You need to audit what you're consuming. 10 times out of 10, you are eating and consuming things that are keeping you in that low vibrational mode. 
You have to raise your vibration. And one of the ways that you can instantly raise your vibration is shifting what you eat. Shifting what you eat to a more whole food, live it. Because it ain't a diet. <laughs> We're actually putting living things into our body. When you put dead flesh into your body, you are consuming the trauma that that creature had to endure when they were getting slaughtered. And it has totally shifted my paradigm. I have more compassion for others. I have more empathy. My cognitive dissonance is aligned. I'm able to resolve conflict with ease. What has changed? Fasting, these fruits. Fasting is the cure. Fasting is the cure. Make sure that you're auditing what you put inside of your body, what you're consuming through your eyes, your ears, your environment. We have to watch all of these things, fam, because all of that plays into how we're feeling. All right. If you rock with this video, fam, give me a like down below. Subscribe to the channel. If you're interested in all things health and wellness, tap in with me. I'm Jazz Avante, licensed massage therapist, your divine healer, relaxing muscles, reviving wellness, man. Love.